Well, can you just, Josh, can you give us a, a little brief idea on like the timeline from when it first entered your mind and to when it was down on paper and ready to cast and ready to start? Absolutely, yeah. Like I said, I came up with the idea in June of 08. Um, I, started wow. writing, I started writing the actual scripts um, after a little bit of just brainstorming, probably a month of that, and actually wrote for probably a year and a half before we sat down and I decided that it was where I wanted it. Mm -hmm. And uh, Matt and I really started talking about shooting the damn thing. Mm -hmm. And then we all sat down as a group, probably I think that was in December when we went to my, we sat down in my apartment, right? Uh, they ripped it apart, said, <laughs> told me all the things that they hated about it. <laughs> um, and that, you know, the, the steps we'd have to take to get it to where they, they thought it was a, a full story, you know? Uh -huh. um, and so I guess that was, a year and eight months before we decided, okay, let's shoot it, and just, uh -huh. just me working on it before we brought in an entire team of people to make it what it's become uh -huh. in the last nine months now. Wow. So was that kind of like the initial meeting of all yeah. of you when you first came together? And well, no, no, we had worked on This is the first meeting about all God's creatures. About all God's creatures, creatures yeah. right. Yeah, we had worked on Bad Apples for we've been about a year been working on uh -huh. Bad Apples, the web series, and the commercials, and what have you. Uh -huh. but, yeah, but that was the first initial meeting of for all God's creatures when you presented it and did everybody say, oh yeah, sure, you know, we're gonna, we can do this. Absolutely not. They had read it in advance. And, I mean, and, 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 like, it, was, it was a situation where Matt and I decided, like, we got, we're shooting the damn film. Like, we're shooting the film. Yeah. We decided this is the most feasible thing right now. So we, you know, we, we send the script to them, we have them read it, we have them meet in my apartment and I'm sitting there hammering on them why, like, no, let's just fucking do it. <laughs> like, like, yes, we can fix it along the way, which is something we will never do again, but, <laughs> yes, you know, like, it's a matter of just let's do it, you know? And, and, I mean, part of it, like Matt said, part of it was just that attitude, like, yes, there are things to be fixed about it, but if we don't just do it, it'll never get done. Right, so, I mean, right. there was an element of that, and they were kind of, like, I guess the buffer, the creative buffer yes, they got well, to. Uh, well, for us, I guess what changed for us was the amount of time we would have to make the fixes that we needed. Um, and it, it sounds, you know, it sounds sort of silly for for the four people, for, our, for the four of us to be sitting here going, "Oh, so that first meeting, everyone was like, gun." I was like, "No, no, in fact, we were totally <laughs> against yeah. doing it." No, they walked in the apartment with the man. I was like, "Well, that could have went better." <laughs> <laughs> but you're, Josh, you're, you're absolutely right. <laughs> on the way home, me and I were talking. It's like, well, yeah, right yeah, now, I don't think we're gonna do really this. I mean, we'll have to see where it goes. We'll have to talk about it. See if we really get it when we like it, and then. Sure, if you're, you're sitting so, today with the movie. So, at what point did you kind of start seeing that yes, it well, could be done? Me and Ryan sat yeah, down together with the script and we started <laughs> talking about what we thought it needed for the story to kind of progress and other little things that it kind of needed to help support the characters and the uh -huh. arc of the story. And after we had that meeting, kind of with I was like, oh, I think we can, we can do this. I think uh -huh. there, was, there was that for me, and then of course also once we got the first main rewrite draft from our ghostwriter, yeah. it was uh -huh. okay. No, this this can actually go somewhere because. Really, okay. what the rewrites did, you know, there was nothing wrong with the story, even from the get-go. It was one thing that we, nobody had a problem with. Like, oh, the story, this is the guy, this is what it goes, this is what happens. It was really with the characters so much. Um, and, you know, Josh obviously wrote it, and he was writing the character for himself, so he fleshed that out a lot more than, say, other characters in the story. Uh -huh. So just for that first rewrite from another person to just flesh out some other characters, just really made the story come alive. And from that first, first rewrite, that was when it was okay. No, even if uh -huh. we shot it as it is right now, we can still make a passable movie.